delegates conference before the end of the year. Those are constitutional matters that you cannot say should not happen. <laughs> no matter what happens, once the party exists and the constitution says every four years you should elect executives, you have to elect executives. What we will want to ex what we expect is that we we are, we are seeing the signs of ostentation, the amount of monies that are being thrown around to entice delegates from a party that has moved this country to an economic mess. You would have expected that they would have been very, very decent in what is happening. But the account, um, accounts we are hearing of monies that are being paid to delegates. The conference should have started at 9 a.m. We're giving 9 a.m. It is past 12. The delegates are holed up meeting with candidates who are giving them monies at this time. Three hours we've been sitting here. For a government that has driven this economy into a mess, you're asking yourself, where are the candidates getting the money? It looks like there are two Ghanas. A Ghana for MPP national executives and MPP functionaries, and a government a Ghana for the rest of us. And it's sad. Right. Would you be surprised, would you be surprised if the MPP party was able to break the eight? I mean, how, how did they break the eight? How did they? I mean, that question should not even be asked. They are going to break the eight, they are breaking themselves into pieces. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you.